So, hi, this is Richards FM with Mark Richards. I have a new playlist to share with you. Um, the playlist is Richards FM, you can find it on Spotify with a bit of luck. Um, and the idea is to just maybe poke some music at you and see if I can introduce you to some new stuff. So, let's get cracking. So the first song is a new version of Eyes Without a Face by Billy Idol. Pulsai remix. It's quite chilled out compared to the other one, or the original. Um, and it's it's really good. I really like it. So there you go. That's that one. The second is an artist called Bride. Uh, her real name is Sarah Howell. She's from Wales. Um, so a couple of albums out. A new album out came out last year called The Volume of Things. And this is a new single from that called Ornaments. And if you've not heard Bride, she's got an awesome voice well worth checking out I would definitely recommend that one as well just because you know, I've got great tasty music um, the third track is by an Australian punk band called The Chats now the, the, if you remember punk when it started and even I'm not old enough for that it was all snot and attitude and teen just, <laughs> just banging your head against a brick wall and this is what The Chats do and the first song I heard was a song called ACDC CD, which is an Australian punk band bigging up Australia's biggest rock band, its quality and its attitude. And I highly recommend the album as well, High Risk Behaviour. Well worth 30 minutes of your time if you're into punk. Proper attitude. So the next song is by a duet with Dub Pistols and Dubmatics. And they've done a version of Blue Monday's uh, new orders even blue monday and it's quality i mean absolute quality there's proper dub on it it's got a good reggae vibe to it and it it, it doesn't stray too far from the original although i do prefer cover versions if they're different from the original so again worth a try and i say you can find all this on the playlist on spotify if you can find that um so yeah well worth a good try that one the next one uh, and don't sneer when I say this, is Gary Newman. He had a quality album out in 2017, I think it was, called Savage Songs from a Broken World, which is, if you've not heard it, really awesome. You can hear some of the Nine Inch Nails influence in it, although it's a lot more accessible than some of Trent Reznor's stuff. Um, and the, the lead single from his new album, which um, is also called Intruder, is Intruder. And there's an edit of it out. And if you want to listen to that, that'll give you a good vibe for where he's at at the minute. If you like something that doesn't sound anything like Cars or We Are Electric or anything else that he's done. Really, really good stuff. Really worth investing your time into. So the next one, uh, Frank Turner. I'm sure you've heard of Frank Turner. It's a duet. Oh, he's on his second uh, compilation album with a chap called John Snodgrass, who actually I don't know a lot about. <clears throat> but this is my lockdown song of the year and I'm not allowed to play anything because I'm literally just making this up as I go along it's the first one I've done so <laughs> um, so the song is called The Fleas there's a single edit of that out as well I mean it, it really just nails the lockdown pandemic whole debacle thing right off for me and you know I really really listen to that really worth it just completely nails it uh the next band is london grammar now they've had they've got a third album coming out in april uh the first two albums i think were okay that i'd listened to nothing really grabbed me but they've had three singles out from the new album which is called californian soil um so the title track for that came out and then there was a second single which i can't remember off the top of my head and the third single, the new one, which came out a couple of weeks ago, is Lose Your Head. Very good video, very good song. Really sort of nails their sort of idea of where they're at now. And again, really good song to listen to. Um, and the next one is Lucy Spraggan. Yeah, you see, you're pulling the face, you're pulling with Gary Newman again, aren't you? I know, I can see you. But Lucy Spraggan makes some quality music. She writes her own songs. She just speaks from the heart, and a lot, a lot of her new stuff 
talks from a sexuality but she she this song why don't we start from here and all, all the stuff that deals with sexuality is quality as well and you know i've really sort of taken to and i'm not a fan of britain's got talent and you know cal can just go in a corner with donald trump and die as far as i'm concerned but lucy spraggan is quality so why don't we start from here new lucy spraggan song catches out really good um and the next one is more chiba so i got into more chiba last year i think i heard blood like lemonade on a netflix show while i was watching again good song to check out if you want to get into them but they've got a new single out called sounds of blue I no idea whether there's no album coming out or not but definitely worth a very chilled out sort of vibe with that one lovely vocals from the singer again worth checking out that one and the next one is phoebe bridges so she had a new album out last year which is good i like a bit of phoebe bridges this version this copycat killer ep that came out last year late last year and there's a song on there called chinese satellite which is a version of a song that was on the second album it's really good it adds guitar to it it's got a lot different vibe to it than the album version and yeah absolute quality as well and the last one i'm going to go for because i've put two wood in the conqueror tracks in here but we're just going to go for one is wood in the conqueror and um, they're a band from cornwall a uh, chap called rory joseph and, and two of his friends have, have created this band and they're on the third album which is coming out in march really really good band really good lyrics really good delivery in his vocals really sort of heartfelt things going on with this it, it, it's sort of sort of country-ish americana -y sort of thing going on but worth it so the, the song i'm going for there is move on which is the latest single uh didn't i think came out last week or this week um and that's again really good stuff so yeah a whole bunch of sort of indie and rock and punk and all sorts of randomy kind of stuff for you to get stuck into so i like eclectic stuff so if you're into that give it a go like i say the playlist is on spotify richards fm if not i'm sure you're capable of finding these things out for yourselves because you're all intelligent people or one of you <laughs> um so yeah that's that i hope that i've poked you into something that you like if so let me know in the comments and i'll see you next time thanks a lot take care cheers